You've probably heard of it and it probably sounds nasty. Yep, it's time to talk about slashing. Any given civil environment is governed by a set of strict rules and regulations. Misbehave once and you're in trouble. Same goes for proof of stake systems. If you behave dishonestly or refuse to fulfill your obligation to vote on blocks, you get punished by the protocol with a mechanism called slashing. In blockchain, slashing exists to establish a control over the network to prevent and punish behaviors that could be detrimental to the system and investors as a whole and ensure a complete balance in the network. Slashing is an event where the validator gives up a defined proportion of staked tokens, which are then burned or redistributed to other stakeholders proportionally. And there are two main actions that may trigger punishment based on the protocol rules, downtime and double signing. But of course, the punishment really depends on the network. Downtime, also known as uptime violation, refers to the activeness of a validator. If the node becomes negligent and is not signing transactions at a particular time frame, the node will be considered inactive and will be punished. At Harmony, we don't really do slashing because of downtime. Validators just stop earning rewards if their node is down. And that's different from getting penalized if they double sign. Now let's talk about double signing. Double signing is the action of signing two blocks at the same block height. If the validator gets caught signing two blocks with one key, the punishment will be more severe compared to downtime punishments. If any BLS keys are detected signing conflicting blocks, i.e. blocks with the same height and view ID but with different block hashes, the validator will be slashed and forever banned from the network. And when a validator is slashed, a certain percentage, i.e. slashing rate, of staked tokens from the validator and its delegators will be forfeited, of which half will be burnt and another half will be credited to the reporter of the double sign event. The slashing rate is calculated by simply summing all the voting power of the double signing keys with a minimum of 2%. For example, if three BLS keys with voting power of 3%, 3% and 4% double signed at the same time, 10% of all staking tokens will be slashed on the validators who hold the three BLS keys. The thing to bear in mind is slashing punishments affect both validators and the delegators staking to them. So make sure you think carefully about which validators you decide to delegate to. And to find out more about delegating, do check out the other films in this series. And remember, delegate, collect, repeat.